Let's talk about the Bianchi 100 Professional. Uh, this is one of my inside the waistband holsters that I carried for a long time. And to be honest with you, it's uh, one of my favorites. It has a couple of small downfalls, which we'll talk about. Uh, but it has a lot of great features as well. So let's get right into it. Uh, the Bianchi 100 comes in tons of different sizes. It just depends on the type of firearm that you carry. This one I ordered specifically for my Rogue uh, to make it easier to carry, which is a 3 inch 1911. Um, it has a really sturdy, uh, heavy duty spring steel clip. This one right here. Uh, does a great job of hanging on to the pants so when you're drawing uh, or reholstering it stays in place as much as possible. Uh, but it's not insanely difficult to put on your pants either, which is nice. I also really like this high back design that they have to minimize rubbing against your body. Uh, if you look with the firearm inside the holster, you can see all the parts of the gun that would normally rub against your skin from time to time are covered, which is nice. It really adds to the comfortability factor also on the back. Uh, it has this kind of suede sort of a feel to it, which is nice. Makes it so that it doesn't irritate the skin as much if you do have that going on. Um, really great high quality cow leather. Uh, I really like uh, the stitching, how well it is and how well it's held up for me. It is a little bit bulkier than some other holsters out there, um, which is something you got to consider. Uh, it weighs a little bit more, but you know what, for comfortability, um, and how the gun goes in and out of the holster, you know, it may not bother you. It didn't bother me. Uh, it's made to be carried on the strong side. Uh, the Bianchi 100 um, it doesn't, isn't built for a cant. That's what I meant to say. So if you can see the holster, the clip is like this. It rides straight up and down. So if you like to carry yours with a cant, then you're going to have to either find another holster or do what I do, just have a belt that's not quite as wide and just cant it anyways. But then it slides around a little bit, so that can be a little bit annoying. Uh, so there you go. Uh, those are some of the things I really enjoy about this holster, but let's get into something that I really dislike about this holster. And that's that it doesn't have a reinforced mouth. And it might have something to do with the comfortability that they were trying to achieve with this uh, by having the back all the one piece. But not having a reinforced mouth means that when the, holst when the pistol is not in the holster and the holster is on your body, then it's going to be closed shut like this, like that, around your pants. Uh, and makes holstering it a little bit uh, more difficult. And it's not just with drawing your weapon. You know, that's when you ride in the car. You know, I have a system in my vehicle for uh, a holster mount in my car. It just makes it more comfortable for long trips and things like that where I don't want to keep it on my waistline the whole time. Um, and then when you go to get out of the car, you've got to reholster and then you got to deal with, you know, now it's closed up. you got to figure that out. Uh, also, you know, just every morning, you know, if you're just putting your holster on and then your gun instead of the gun within the holster, there's just lots of little times when you'll run into that being just annoying more than anything else. Um, so reholstering, yeah, it makes it a little bit difficult, but you know you got to pick and choose what you want out of out of a holster. Um, as much as I like having a reinforced mouth, I love carrying this one because of how comfortable it is. I've carried others that do have a reinforced mouth that aren't as comfortable. So it just depends on what you want. Um, so check it out, uh, Bianchi 100 Professional, uh, great quality uh, for the money. You can see like how far it rides down in there too. Let me go ahead and slide this under there so you can see if this were your pants, okay? That's how much of the gun comes up. So there's more leather and things like that, but as far as the gun out of the pants, uh, it's very comparable to most others out there. So they did a good job with that. Like I said, no can't. Uh, it's all about just finding the balance of what you want. Um, I really like a cant and I really like a reinforced mouth, but I also like a comfortable holster. So it just depends. I switch them out all the time, but uh, this is one that I've been carrying a lot lately and thought I'd share it with you guys so you can check it out. Bianchi 100 Professional. Go take a look.